Hey everyone, it's Coconut and Jay here, and today we're going to be talking about the Man of War, which personally is my best assault rifle. Not only because it looks sexy as hell, it's also very powerful, and if used correctly in hardcore, you can tear shit Now, up. the Man of War in hardcore literally threads through people, and I'm not even joking. This thing is literally a one-shot kill anywhere. I don't know about range, but I don't think you can get that far from the map that range would even become a factor especially if you've got long barrel on but this gun is pretty much a one shot kill on hardcore on a normal tdm or normal whatever it's gonna be maybe a two to three shot kill but um i use i'm just starting to play hardcore lately i've been really enjoying it as well because it's it's it, you die a lot more but if you play good you can go on literally some mean ass kill streaks um camping can also help you out there but i wouldn't recommend camping because who likes to camp me? Not me. <laughs> this gameplay I did like literally 20 minutes ago and I just thought, wow, this gun needs to be talked about because it's... I don't, I don't see many people using it. I saw one person have it in gold and have you seen it in gold? In gold it looks absolutely gorgeous. Like, it looks like um, like, like a chocolate bar. Yeah. I'd just like to apologize for the lack of videos lately. Um, if you follow um, me on my main channel or on social media sites, you'll know that where I live, we had a flood and we had to um, lit pretty much evacuate the house and put all the camera equipment in my friend's house. And not long ago, we only set it back up. And then this week has been university deadline week, which kind of sucks. And I've had to like get a load of work done. Um, and I've also got my Twin Coconuts channel. So my time is kind of like taking up, but I promise I am going to upload more frequently on this channel. I do love gaming and I've got a lot of gameplays that um, are ready to be watched. Um, just need to edit them and export them and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I want you guys to comment on this video telling me what games you want me to play. Um, a lot of people want me to play scary games and the last scary game I played was called Eyes and I played that on my own and <laughs> To be honest with you, on my own, in my own, because I have a, my own home, um, and Harrison wasn't in, and so I was quite scared. I mean, my home's like, for me myself, it's quite big, um, and I heard a creepy footstep. That's literally as soon as I played it, and it got me a little bit scared. But I grew up, I realized I am a man now, I need to take things on the chin, so I said, no ghost, go away. But well, turns out there wasn't no ghost there, because there's no such thing as ghost. But yeah, uh, if you want to play scary games, just let me know. I will play them. And if you want to play them at night, I suppose I'll play them at night. I don't really want to, but, you know, it makes me more scared, I imagine. There's a lot uh, There's a lot of scary games that I've seen on YouTube because I myself watch gameplays on YouTube quite a lot. Uh, it's probably one of the main things I watch. That and uh, I like to watch uh, technology like cell phones and stuff like that. <laughs> um, yeah, so I watch... Um, scary games and there's a lot of scary games that i've seen being played um, and i won't mind playing them myself so just give me a comment telling me what scary games you want to play and i'll be sure to play them anyway thanks for joining me on this short little episode um i'd just like to apologize again for the lack of videos but i'm gonna get back on track i hope you have a great day and i hope you stay tuned for more videos peace out my friends i love you all